Don't miss any content. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So, Arsenal were playing uh, the final round of games uh, in the match uh, week 8 against Aston Villa. And unfortunate here, the Ghanaian player Thomas Partey. This is breaking news. Thomas Partey suffered an injury in that game. An injury blow. He was sapped off at half time, and all indications are pointing uh, towards a certain thigh injury. And it looks uh, more and more likely that Partey might not. Uh, be able to make it for the AFCON uh, qualifier game. Ghana has a double header with Sudan. Uh, this could put CK Akono and the Black Stars in a fix. Uh, more details set to come out uh, about this, uh, but um, we'll be keeping tabs on it. But the latest is Thomas Pate had an ice pack on his thigh at half time and was replaced by Danny Sebayo. So it's the latest day on the front of Thomas Te Pate and Arsenal suffered an injury in that game against Aston Villa which they were trailing by a goal to know before he went off so we'll be keeping tabs on it and keep you guys updated let's go over for the news for today welcome back to Sahara football so we all know this coming week the Ghana Black Stars will be taking part in the AFCON 2021 qualifier game versus Sudan and uh, so many late call-ups are coming through because we all know what's happening across the world with the pandemic and everything uh, causing maybe travel restrictions where the players who have been called are supposed to come through from um, so CK Akonov trying to make up for that uh, with late uh, call-ups to other players uh, but uh, while i was looking for any other late call-up to other players i could find i found out that the Ghanaian player uh, bernard mensah he put out a tweet um, saying that he had quit the ghana black stars he said um, i have decided to take a break uh, from the national team until further notice I want to concentrate on my career, which I think he meant club career. Thanks to all the Ghanaians for their support. I'll be giving you my thoughts on this latest breaking news coming from a Ghanaian player, Bernard Mensah, as well, and see what it could mean for the Black Stars moving forward and the probable reasons and reactions on social media to his decision to quit the Ghana black stars you'll subscribe if you haven't and click on the notification bell to get more updates so the breaking news is that bernard mensah uh, who was called up for ghana in october for the friendlies against mali and qatar has decided to quit the ghana black stars reports arrive uh, that he was unhappy about the fact that he will not uh, who was not called up for the afcon 2021 double header with sudan uh, truth of the matter uh, being in that he felt he was better than some of the players that had been called up uh, this is what i think because the players like emmanuel lomote uh, did not impress at uh, the um, friendlies against mali uh, he didn't even play the qatar game but bernard mensah feels uh, he has been tremendous in turkey and uh, for the past few years was at kisera sport uh, before making that move to besiktas uh, he felt uh, he is a player of a high high pedigree uh, that uh, should have been included in CK Akono's uh, final squad for the AFCON uh, qualifier. Um, I, I, I personally think uh, this decision uh, was too rash, uh, but he says he wants to focus on his club uh, career and make the most out of the club career that he has now. And uh, now he says in, the t in this tweet earlier uh, today that I have decided to take a break from the national team until further notice. I want to concentrate on my career for now thanks to all Ghanaians for their support obviously there have been a lot of reaction to this uh, news of Bernard Mensah quitting the Ghana Black Stars and uh, some people are in agreement with him that he should quit the Black Stars calling players like Barbara Mann who hasn't played first team football for a top club and he is not able to make a team that contains Barbara Mann and Emmanuel Lomote players especially Emmanuel Lomote he feels he is better than I think it is something that needs addressing but bernard mensa has said that he's taking a break from ghana black stars uh, the reactions coming through uh, one here coming says i am with you i'm not happy 
I'm always not happy with the treatment of you in the Black Stars. Why the hell were you not? Uh, why the hell were you not part of the Black Stars uh, call up, uh, um, uh, dear Oliver? As Besiktas fans, we trust you. We know everything will be better for you and our team. Um, Besiktas fans supporting him in his decision. We will be waiting for your comeback soon. All the best in your career. Um, focus, uh, concentrate on Besiktas. Uh, that's one. God bless every decision you make. Amen. Is that even allowed? Report him to FIFA. <laughs> Uh, you only played five games. Uh, oh, <laughs> uh, we trust you, Bernard. Um, we believe in you. We believe in you. It's the right decision. <laughs> he said, Your pastor asked you to take a break. Eh? <laughs> uh, the, 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 the reactions coming in are varied, but personally, I don't think this um, announcement was necessary, in my opinion. And I might be wrong. I don't think it's it's, it's in his best interest to quit the national team. We all know various stories of players who have publicly said uh, they quit the national team, focus on their club career, and the club career they wanted to focus on did not end up well. The truth is, uh, the service to the national team is not something that uh, should be taken for granted, and you should always be open uh, to play for the national team. In my opinion yes he hasn't been treated well yes he deserves to be caught up ahead of other players yes 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 to all that but the truth on the ground is that uh, the best way he could have answered these people uh, was to play his football and let his football do the talking for him and now he is openly um, quitting the Ghana Black Stars openly saying he will no longer play for Ghana for until further notice I don't even know what that means. If this is not, if you are going to quit the Ghana Black Stars, quit the Black Stars. It's like holding someone to ransom because you were not called up. There are a lot of other competent players who were not called up, but they won't all rush out to come and do this. Bernard Mensah, I understand this is personal decision. He's a different human being. He can't think like me and the way I think. Uh, but this is what I think about his decision. I don't think it was right for him to quit the Black Stars. I don't think uh, quitting the Black Stars is the answer to this situation we have here. I just feel he could have approached it better. I just think he didn't need to make out this statement. Be at your place and play your football. Let it do your talking for you. We all know the situation of Kujua Samoa right now. He decided to focus on, the black, on his club career for four years. 2014 to 2018 he returned and it was never the same for him so the club career he was focusing on uh, did not end well for him uh, there are so many instances over there it's not the right thing uh, the national team service is really immense it helps you a lot it puts you on the map internationally and i don't think bernard mensa uh, made uh, the right decision and 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 i don't think this was the right decision for him but what do you think about bernard mensa quitting the ghana black stars some people are saying because he wasn't selected let me know what you think why you think he has quit the ghana black stars and uh, he is focusing on his club career i know story has to do with jordan ayu and his coach roy hodgson he says he is not happy about sense are real let me know your thoughts in the comments box uh, bernard mensa has quit at the ghana black stars he says until further notice jordan are coach is hesitant to let him go your thoughts in the comments box on everything i'll see you guys in the next one enjoy your day